each other tips, maybe the best one will say, if you don't want to come fast, think about something else. Ah! <laughs> it's not it's how a brain. So you don't, when it's you just, don't come fast, you think about your friends? I think about my high school principal. Every time I want to come, I just you, think about that. You know, like imagine you being on the job and thinking about your principal. It's like that, you think about something. <laughs> With them secrets, yeah. <laughs> it's so our brains oh, are something. No That's why, and our brains are something that it, it, it brings a memory to you. Honestly, mm-hmm. That's why it, it takes me back to this. When someone asks me, says, "Why did you want to be a uh, living? In, it, it, you don't have to get a certificate to get money or to get revenue income. Let's push. It, uh, uh, we, one thing about the, I love about them, their slogan is says, "Be innovative to the future." And the future can be everything. It's their slogan, not mine. Mm-hmm. So you having a podcast. San Bonani Dumelang, hello, I'm Shani, good people. Welcome to CC Podcast Student Life, a space filled with entertainment, enthusiasm, raw talent, true passion, and bigger ambition. You name it, we got it. Meet the most amazing, eyeful, fine like wine, a sparkling personality, our very own, of its kind, our host, Karabo, aka The Ghost. Woo! Alongside with who? JD. Take our time. Crack a snack, I make keep keep and some sip, some more fire, and you feel the heat as we coming in hot. Hey, ghost, welcome to Kenton Conversation Podcast. It's all up our studio last. Back and relax, enjoy and stay tuned for more content. Hey, yo, what's up, good people? This is a boy, Ghost. Welcome to Kating Conversation Podcast. It's all about student life. You know the vibes. For now, I'm doing things differently. I got Jade around Yay. for the first time this year. Yay. <laughs> and the guys, I have a very special guest. This guy was invited to the campus. See, this is Damelin Brafantin. He's the president of the school. I don't know president for what, but he's the president. fucking president. Woo! <laughs> woo, 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 woo. <laughs> so, if my bride was good, thank you both for inviting us. Thank, 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 Welcome. Hi. So, <laughs> before before we get nasty and shit, I wanna I wanna jump back to your background. Okay. okay. Tell us who is who who is. Where's who from? <laughs> oh, you know that. Edward, I am. <laughs> oh, yeah. Usually, school is a vibrant name. Oh, okay. yeah. Most of school, you know that there are people who are outspoken. You find them there and there. Thank you. You never find a quiet school. It's highly impossible. Okay, there are, there are schools that are quiet, but it's most impo- impossible to find them. And you are very talkative. Yeah, yeah very I'm sure. Talkative. I believe so. I've been told. I've but. Seen <laughs> so, re- regarding my background, guys, I'm just a guy from Mekasi, Kolele Kleni, from Etlen, Aplomerok Vini. But I can't stay at Ramsar. So I'm someone who has always been like an outthink, I'm a future, an overthink. I always wanted to change the surrounding that, that I am or around, you see. Because yeah. I'm one people who likes to be an impact around people that I'm around. Someone who likes to see changes, not seeing things being done, yeah. like in a routine thinking. Okay. Which takes me to what I'm doing now as a person, being a, being a president, being into IT, because I like problems. And rational yeah. thinking. Yeah. yeah. Yo, so, IT, most okay. niggas with the IT, they watch porn, eh? <laughs> <laughs> that's, the, that's the concept out there that IT people are we are net, we we being called net and stuff. But no, yeah. it depends with the person, the, the, the bringing up of a person that where you come from, yeah. your ambitions, what you love and stuff. I can be like me. For some people, it's, even my friends, it's hard when you tell them like I'm doing IT because they know me as someone who's always out partying, doing stuff. Yeah. So. Imagining me on a computer typing yeah, is kind of a different scenario. You see, so it depends with you as a person what are your missions. And your missions are not defined by where you come from or who you are, you see. So as long as you say us about something or get your mind about it, you can go forward in life. It's just about giving it your own. Yeah, I'm really Yeah, I'm you right. can actually. So as you are the president of Demlin yes. campus, so can you please tell us more about that? 
Yeah. How the hell do you become like, how the president? Fuck do you, like in the institute. Oh. Did you brag? Yo, yo, yo. Kuru meno bad ba. Oh, and it's a long story, but to cut it short, it's like when I came to Demelin, I came. I was a media intern. Yeah. So. From outside, you know, everything looks well from outside. Each and every institution you go to, from the outside, it will look like everything is going well, it's smooth flowing. But once I was seen in Temelin, I saw a lot of flaws, mostly especially when it comes to students and lectures. There was no clear communication between them. So when I came back for my media intake, it was the joint January. I decided to help students because most of the students were having problems with portals. Some of yeah. them didn't know where to go. They were new. Some of them didn't come out their original mix, so they were lost, to, to be honest. So I started taking part in helping them around, showing them, giving them their numbers if they had problems. They must do this and this and this and this. And actually, there was an SRC committee that was there in place, but it's just that it was not visible. There was just an SRC that was there on boards, but you wouldn't see them around. So. The uh, GM, which is the school chief, general manager, came to me and asked me that, am I interested in becoming part of the SRC since she has seen me that I'm committed and I'm trying my best to help students around. So we sat down, we came up with a plan to create a new committee from scratch, start afresh, find people who are more passionate about their work on helping students, not only for their for our own benefits. My benefit as a person, to be honest, seeing students happy will benefit me. That means I've achieved my goals and my, my objectives as a person. But for someone, some people want to be in the community because they want to be seen. They want to be in the community because they want to be known. Some people think maybe in the community there's special treatment, there's bazaars, no. In fact, once you're in the community, there's more work than being a normal student. Yeah, it's like me. Now normal. you're doing things for yes. students, you know, you must trying be, uh, to have, make students have a good time at campus and also protect the students from... Everything goes wrong, you don't want to blame. If students have problems and you can assist them, so, so, like accountability of students falls on you. Accountability is a good thing, but it depends on how do they define accountability. With our students, we have a problem. If a student comes to you and says, I'm having a problem with my classes, or I'm failing yeah. my modules, they expect you to, some students might expect you to do miracles and help them pass all those modules. But which sometimes is not the case. My, my role as a president is to make sure that the students are helped or they're given the best education to, the, to, to their best abilities. In, in that saying, I'm saying like, if a lecture is hired to teach a student this subject or this module, mm-hmm. that lecture must be there for the student. Mm-hmm. If a, a student must be in classes, they must be in classes on time. It goes both ways. You can't be a, as a student, don't come to classes, then and then complain, complain and lectures. stuff like, yeah, no, See? that's not going to work. So don't be that student, guys. Be better. Hey, so yeah, it's for yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> It goes, it goes like that. For now, students were having complaints about the facilities, mm-hmm. things that were broken. Today, Ada and I had a meeting with the GM to take in some of those problems. And I'm one person, if I'm given a task, I'll be, what can I, how can I put it? I'll be more open than to try and add stuff. I went to the GM and I brought the outcome. The outcome was for the GM. She will try to fix those things, but not all of them due to the budget constraints that they have. Yeah. We know that we have SCOM. There must be this import for the generator, which uh, for us, uh, 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 cost for the, for the school. But as we are moving to more challenges and factors, that also affects the student learning. Right? Yes, it does, because we need electricity, yes. because we use our laptops, and our laptops need those to be charged, as well as the Wi Fi. Yes. Because Everything. we also have load sharing at home, so when you come to a school, you at least expect it to be on the lights. We won't really yeah. be having this video if it was not for electricity. So <laughs> yes, so it's definitely. It yes. So, bro, since we are president of this school, I want to ask you something crazy. Obviously, you, you that guy came past. Are you getting ass? Is there any like, ass on campus, you know? And you're the president. Like, who doesn't want to fuck the president? That, someone once asked me that, since you are the president, that means you have to call themselves who are you. Yes. Maybe you have more chances to get girls than us. And it doesn't work like that. You see, I'm one person, I believe, if a girl can throw me himself or herself to, to me because I'm a president, what happens when I step down? Mm. What happens when I'm no longer a president? Okay. I'm, that, maybe currently, I don't know if I should be telling you this, but I'm saying it to, to one reason, to, to one main reason. It's because I don't want to be in a relationship with someone who dates me because of what I have materially or what I'm being equipped. In life, there's ups and downs. Today, you can be yeah. a president, tomorrow I can be a normal student. And I'm not in the president for a winning game or what. I'm here to help people. So if I get someone to this, it will be me being in love or me liking that person, but not because I'm a president. 
maybe me, me being a president might get us get to know each other or hey, come to me, have a numbers, but not because I'll be using it as my advantage to get hairs and stuff, man. <laughs> Yeah, but they do actually have perks and advantages, you know, because now you know you'll get S because females want to fuck with you for benefits, so they'll just fuck you for benefits, you know. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, Okay, so let's get to the interesting part. So we saw a poster about you hosting an event at yes. your campus, so can you tell us more about that? Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. so as I've told you that, we wanted to do things, do, do things different this year, so which was implementing new activities, making students feel more at home, you see. But like, school must not be only a learning-based thing, so students must be free. That's why you can come, you can see behind the students are here learning, some of them are having fun. That's how campus must be, it must not only, only be about learning and stuff. So, so it should be fun, mm, booze and ablaze and nice time. See, people students. must have nice time. So I, yeah. me and my team sat down and we came up with a plan of creating a new way to communicate and or maybe connect with students. So one of it was an event, which the event is mainly based on raising money for sports. Because I saw for that, sports. yeah, for sports. So Demlin is like a sports, what, what, what? Apparently they didn't have a sports, but they didn't have funds for that sports. Because they were sports, but kids, they were missing kids during lockdown, after lockdown. Yeah. Kids went missing. Soccer boots you're missing. Sometimes when players have to go in, I'm also part of the sports because I play soccer. So when we have to go and play soccer, there's no money for transport. We have to take it out of our pockets. So it's constraining as a player. Just imagine I'm being a player. I have to train. I have to be. I have to be worried of if I go to the. How will I get to the crowds? How what will I eat? What will I wear? There's no kid and those stuff. So we ca- I came up with an idea. Oh, let me let because I'm not alone. I'll be lying. I have a team that works very hard behind me, so which is all my secretary, my treasury, yeah, my chair. Oh, so, so we came up with a plan that let's do an event whereby we'll be giving back while getting something, rather than asking for donations. So it's better if you know we come to we come to students and say, guys, please meet us halfway by giving us such money for terrace yeah. tickets, so that we know with their tickets they get something in return. There'll be sound, there'll be music, there'll be there'll food. There'll be fun time. So will they be selling food? Yes, there'll be food. There'll be price stands there outside there, and people will be Oh, okay, hey, hey, hey. hey. There'll be disco hey. lights, there'll be MCs, there'll be live performers, there'll be live bands, so live games, wow. arcade games, houses to be won. So we're trying as much to give back as much as we can get something. Yeah. It must be a 50 minutes. I can't expect students to come and donate for a fundraise while they're not getting anything. Of course, there, there are some rules who can say, I don't mind contributing or mind donating to the school. But sometimes, be fair, don't misuse people or because I have the power of saying we can contribute to this, 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 this. Give people something in return so that they can be happy and not be worried of, I spend my first And Next, I'm not enjoying it because, you know, as students will be like, oh, my, I don't want to come. What if it's going to be boring? Yes. No. So we, our 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 truth is to make sure that we make it as best as we can. I cannot promise people to, that there will be much fun because I don't want to be liable at the end of the day. But I'll promise people that there will be all of those things that I've just mentioned. Yeah. There will be sound, there will be snacks, there will be food, there will be, be security. You, know, you see, you see. You have, but you can't just expect you to make it fun. You can provide facilities to make it fun, and the students should come and enjoy themselves. Yes, enjoy themselves. How? That's the question. They should enjoy themselves by dancing to the music, eating the food, being so social. You see, what, getting once I, drunk. I, yeah, yeah, getting drunk, high. I want to count to that. I want to count But what I was saying is that, you see when you say students must come and enjoy themselves, students think differently. Someone can say, me smoking drugs is me enjoying myself. <laughs> <laughs> if that's true, you might try to deny it, but it's what's happening out there. Someone can say, me being wasted is me enjoying myself. Yeah, like everybody has their own perspective. Yes. So as much as students must come and enjoy themselves, themselves they must be responsible as possible. Because at the end of the day, this is a school. So, so in terms of the security, you know, yeah. it's after an event. There should be protocols, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. After an event, hey, my spam or my spoon, my lap, you can't do it. So, what is the safety like? What I can say, I want to lie and try to promise you things that I can't do. Yeah. The only thing that has been... I, that I can reach with my power is that to make sure that the campus, around the campus is safe. Yes. We have yeah. even took a permit, a permit to the police station asking for police to be around the area for that day. Oh, yeah. So there will be a, a, a van escorting the area maybe two times in 30 minutes time it will come 
a squad, then it's, it's out. But that's what I can do. I cannot maybe have security from here until Bray takes the ring. That's out of my reach. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some, like someone can say, okay, we'll be safe in campus. What happens when you're out there? Yeah. But that's how it is in life. You're always safe in campus. What happens on your everyday basis when you're out there? Yeah. So that's how it is. So when will this fun event be taking place? Okay, guys, the event will be taking place on the 26th of May, which is next week Friday. Yes. Next week Friday is a hala, baba. No. <laughs> I saw good you bought a magic from nine to five. So those are the TVs that you take it up, take them out so that you can see. Also, you'll send us the post and then yeah, we'll fly it. And, uh, and, and I, I also designed it. See, I'm also a designer in a way. Oh, okay, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Hey, guys. Yeah. So get one of these and fuck bitches and get home safe. Thank you. Yeah, guys. Like 40 yes. Honestly, we're planning to achieve two things. Mainly with this event is for fundraising the funds of the sports and stuff. But one of the things we're planning to achieve, that's how we have created our school social media that platform that, that just went up today, which is our own TikTok, our own Twitter, our own Instagram, our own Facebook, is to make an environment whereby students can connect. It cannot be through an event only, but to get the commitment of the students. Students must know that they can rely on us. That's why I'm not only promoting an event, but I'm also promoting a way of students they must know that things have changed. It's not like yeah. before. If your problems come to us, if there's something that you want to achieve come to us, I might be a president, but I won't have every idea. Mm. If you as, a, you as a student have a new idea of how to do things, come to us. And if it's reasonable enough, we'll take it and take it to the GM, to the re- relevant parties. Because mm. our job, one thing they must understand with us, us being an SRC committee doesn't mean that we are the ones who are making changes. We just take them down, write them down, then take them to the GM, the academic principal and the lecturers. Then we say, guys, there's this, this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Please help us, yes. How can you meet us? Meet us halfway, at least. Like for yeah. today, students were complaining about the old student cards. Yeah. So I went to the GM and I talked to the GM about the student cards. She was, I, I think it was our fourth conversation, we're having those same, the same conversation, until she agreed to the that, okay, the only thing they can do is that since the, it's already the middle of the semester, from next semester, each and every student of the middle will have a student card, whereby there will be your picture and stuff, your name and what's what. What the what students are using now will be used as, as permits. There's cards that are used. So some students are paying monthly. Yeah, there's access cards. We use as payments because some students pay yearly, some pay monthly. So they use as payments. That was the first thing I I, I talked to Jim, which was one of the complaints by the students. Then there were toilets. Some were complaining that toilets were dirty and stuff. Those things. So today we got a feedback that from today, floor number two won't be working at all. It's closed until there's further renovations done. So that's what I'm trying to tell you that we're trying to tackle problems, but if they can, they might take longer, but we'll achieve them at the end. Yeah, like good things take time, guys. Easy. Like you can't just rush. The it sounds like you're a busy guy, bro. Yeah, like very busy. <laughs> very like busy. Your, your mind so is. When it comes to your studies, yeah. how do you balance it? That's the that's the thing. In life, once you take up something, you must have a plan before. Even before I, I took this role, I, 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 I had to sit down and ask myself, will I maintain what will happen? And I have to think, even if with my community, they're all students. That's one thing I must do. That's why we've divided our time according, because we know they all have classes from Wednesdays till Thursdays. Which are from Tuesdays, sorry, from Tuesdays till Thursdays. So we decided that every Mondays and Fridays, the SRC committee meets from 12 o'clock to 2 o'clock. That's their whole day. Meaning, we have our meeting, an hour meeting in the morning. After the hour meeting, we deal with the student. That we have, we have meetings with every student that is, that is a, for, is a problem. A student that wants a feedback. There are sometimes you might bring a problem, you must get your feedback. Yeah. If it didn't go well, I'll tell you that, my guy, I tried this and this and this, this is the outcome I got. But that's what we do every day from every Mondays and Fridays. That's the least we can do. I can't be here every day or every weekend. I also have a life to live. Yeah. I also yeah, have studies to yeah. so see. But the little time I get, I try and make sure that I use it as to But now, you see now, today's Friday. I was supposed to be home now doing my things. My gents are waiting for me. Hey. You see, a cooler box is like getting oh, empty. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Those are the things. And like, when I get home, you see, I'll still get a text from a, a student because my numbers are full on those ones. You can go from down, upstairs to downstairs and find my numbers. What's Someone the, to, sorry to interrupt you, what's the social media platform? Social media the platform names, for now, the ones that, are, the ones that are, I'm, 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 I'm aware of, that I know is the TikTok, which is Demelin Bram. 
Demelin underscore Pram Kipsa Letters. Demelin Pram. Demelin Pram. And if you're interested, these tickets are 40 rand. Go to Demelin Pram. So is, is it only for students, for Demelin students who can bring? No, it's not for Demelin students only because I saw it's going to be unfair. Whenever there's an event that's hosted by a facility or a private college, once you call only internal students, it becomes a problem because for you, example, you, want to, you might want to bring your partner. Yeah, my boyfriend. And your age. boyfriend. Is, ah, you know, yes. You know, you know your boyfriend works here at Absa. <laughs> see, for example, you know your boyfriend works here at Absa. So yeah. how will he come from Absa to here? So you see those things. Maybe they say your girlfriend works here at KFC. She I must mean, be here at the event. So you see, you must... They yeah, wish me. Yeah. 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 So that's what we saw. So let's, get, let's get a little here. Let's get a little bit. Let's get a little bit. Let's get a little bit. Let's socialize. Be merry. Yeah. Okay. You I'm know, the fucking headliner, bro. You see?